Hello, good evening and welcome to our evening service at St Thomas's Mallow near Stockport. Uh, my name is David Shercliffe and I'm one of the ministers there at, at the church and you're very welcome to our service. And as is our tradition, we like to light a candle at the beginning of the service. So if you have a candle, maybe you'd like to join me now. We do this as a focus for us to remember that Jesus is always with us. The eternal God is your refuge and underneath are the everlasting arms. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. And now this is a chance just to ponder the day and think about the good things and the things that we can give thanks to God for. And a chance to to think about the things that maybe aren't so good or things that we've done and said or thought and just come um, humbly to God and offer those and ask for, for, for forgiveness. And we offer up our plans for tomorrow and what we hope for and how we can get to know the Lord that much better and be aware of God throughout the day. Save us, O Lord, while waking and guard us while sleeping that awake we may watch with Christ, and sleep may rest in peace. And our psalm for today is Psalm 16, and it'll be followed by the Gloria sung by the choir at the cathedral at the occasion of Liz's um, light, um, installation of the canon. And then it'll be followed by a reading from Zephaniah. So Psalm 16. Preserve me, O God, for in you I take refuge. I have said to the Lord, you are my Lord. All my good depends on you. All my delight is upon the godly that are in the land, upon those who are noble in heart, through the idols of legion that many run after, their drink Offerings of blood I will not offer, neither make mention of their names upon my lips. The Lord himself is my portion and my cup. In your hands alone is my fortune. My share has fallen in a fair land. Indeed, I have a goodly heritage. I will bless the Lord who has given me counsel. And in the night watches, he instructs my heart. I have set the Lord always before me. He is at my right hand. I shall not fall. Wherefore, my heart is glad and my spirit rejoices. My flesh also shall rest secure. For you will not abandon my soul to death nor suffer your faithful one to see the pit. You will show me the path of life. In your presence is the fullness of joy, and in your right hand are the pleasures forever evermore.
first lesson is taken from Prophet Zephaniah, chapter 3, from verse 14. A song of joy. Sing aloud, O daughter of Zion. Shout, O Israel. Rejoice and exult with all your heart, O daughter Jerusalem. The Lord has taken away the judgments against you. He has turned away your enemies. The King of Israel, the Lord, is in your midst. You shall fear disaster no more. On that day, it shall be said to Jerusalem, Do not fear, O Zion. Do not let your hands grow weak. The Lord your God is in your midst, a warrior who gives victory. He will rejoice over you with gladness. He will renew you in his love. He will exult over you with loud singing as on a day of festival. I will remove disaster from you so that you will not bear reproach for it. I will deal with all your oppressors at that time. And I will save the lame and gather the outcast. And I will change their shame into praise and renown in all the earth. At that time, I will bring you home. At the time when I gather you, for I will make you renowned and praised among all the peoples of the earth when I restore your fortunes before your eyes, says the Lord. The end of the first lesson. Merciful God, we entrust to you your unfailing and tender care this night. Those who are ill or in pain, knowing that whatever danger threatens, your everlasting arms are there to hold us safe. Comfort and heal them, and restore them to health and strength, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. O present, be present, O merciful God, and protect us through the silent hours of this night, so that we who are wearied, by the changes and chances of this fleeting world, may rest upon your eternal changelessness through Jesus Christ our Lord. Let me say uh, uh, the Lord's Prayer together in the um, contemporary form. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. In peace, we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face to shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly upon us and give us peace. Amen. Good night and have a peaceful evening.